All right, guys, check this out. I'm at the uh, on the runway at the 50 most beautiful people Espanol, um, and they're building uh, step and repeats, and there's going to be a bunch of famous people. But as you can see, this is a Toyota Corolla, and the license plate says selfie on it, right? Uh, let's take a selfie. So on the front of the vehicle, there's a big mechanical arm uh, that this gentleman back here, awesome, super cool guy, actually made that takes a picture of itself with the celebrities. Anyways, the point of the story is I have to prepare this car, I had to prepare this car for the one way so that it looked perfect. We put a bunch of Carnuba wax on, uh, I cleaned the wheels perfectly, we actually had to sand it and buff it down, it was not in great shape. But anyways, this is kind of uh, one of the cool events I want to take you along. There's not a whole ton of information uh, under the circumstances that we can go over in terms of uh, detailing, but I give you this, when you're uh, on the runway, in particular here, or doing anything else with a car like this, Carnuba wax is number one, Carnuba wax. I just put a nice light layer on, and I put multiple ones, so when the lights turn on, which they're not on, they're off, as they're building things, it's gonna pop like crazy. So I'll take some more uh, footage of you. Just wanted to bring you along, this is kind of fun uh, experience. Two days before the big event, I compounded the car with the Roops 21, ammo leveler, and the Meguiar's microfiber cutting pad in six inches. Then I polished with ammo jewelers and a green foam pad before adding skin. At the same time, Rob from Infinite Tint, you remember him from the Drive Clean Tint episode, is installing window cling, not window tint, for a very specific reason. You see, I need to quickly remove the tint immediately after the show in New York City before the car gets shipped out to California that same night. So the goal is to hide the engineers inside operating the arm from the celebrities and the cameras taking pictures outside. So this requires the windshield to be tinted as well, thus making it illegal and virtually impossible to drive, so we had to trailer it to the show. The following day, Austin and his team of designers assembled the arm to make sure all the components were working well prior to the red carpet. After a few tests, it was time to disassemble, pack the arm, and head to New York City to start the process all over again. This time, we had to run power, internet, backup batteries, and even a few fans inside the car to keep all four operators cool in such a tight spot for four hours during the event. All the while behind us, teams were laying carpet, constructing backdrops, and stapling step and repeat banners as quickly as possible. All right, guys, I'm inside the Toyota Corolla for the shoot, and the reason why it's so dark is we tinted the windows. I mean, we tinted them at 5%. Again, I have my camera uh, at the ISO 12,800, so it's got, it's trying to grab any light it can. Anyways, you can see I'm inside the car. And right there is the arm that they're building. So uh, this is the event that we're at for the 50 Most Beautiful People Latina. Um, and I'll take you through the day of all the work that's gonna go into place and making sure this car looks amazing for the event. As you can see here, when the overhead lights were being tested, I snapped a few photos to show how the layering of skin, then cream, gives the paint that wet look that's great for camera shots. Every few minutes though, before the next celebrity came down the carpet, I would lightly de-dust the cream with spit spray wax and a brand new microfiber towel. All right, so the red carpet has clearly started. Check it out. There are a lot of people here, but more importantly, my car is looking good and they're taking selfies of it. So it's, uh, it's turning out pretty, uh, pretty nice. Lots of really beautiful people here, it's a lot of fun. is over. Uh, what I have to do now is remove the tints and get the heck out of here because it's been a very, very long day. Here's the step and repeat. Pretty cool thing that they were working on before. And then the arm over there uh, needs to come down, but uh, there's still people walking in. This is how you take off uh, window tint, but this is with cling, not normal window tint. So I use this special kind just so it peel, it peel off. So check this out. So 
that's just like the, the that's just like the window cling that goes on the you know when you put it on you have babies in the back seat and you just put that little piece just to knock the, the light down that's what i did for this one because it's really late at night and i don't want to sit here using a razor blade to, to to get all the glue off and it worked perfectly so a little trick there all right guys thanks for watching i'll see you next week